What's up everybody? So today we're going to take a virtual look at the all new McLaren 570S. And if you enjoy the video, be sure to comment, like, and share it. Don't forget to subscribe to us on YouTube, follow us on Instagram, and like us on Facebook. So we were at a McLaren dealership in Florida and they handed us this very cool card. And we'll use the McLaren 570S app and we'll show you how it all looks. So this is the new McLaren 570S. We'll go ahead and take a look at a 3D rendering of it. So this car is part of McLaren's new Sport series, so this is a step below the 650S. And this has a slightly detuned version of the 3.8 twin turbo V8, pumping out around 560 horsepower. So with this app, we'll go ahead and open up the doors. Then we can change the exterior colors into some of the other standard colors. Then we'll match the wheels and brake calipers as well. So this car being a step below the 650S, the price range is around 180 grand. So it's not too bad for an amazing car like this. And with this lower price, it does not have active aerodynamics like this 650S. So they've designed this car to be very aerodynamic without anything active. And you can see this cool airflow. And you can see the air going through the signature flying buttress behind the windows and going into the side vents. And then the rear is shaped for a spoiler. And if you don't have this card, you can actually go to McLaren's website and download the PDF for this 570S, 650S, and the P1. So if you have a phone and a tablet or just two smartphones, you can do the same thing, which is very cool. So unlike the 650S, you cannot actually open the engine compartment of this vehicle. This little square piece right there opens up to put windshield washer fluid and I think your oil in there. The only way to get to the actual engine is for a service technician to do they need to do any maintenance on it or anything like that. And then you get the same trunk up front and then a nice shelf behind the front seats. We'll take a look at the inside a little bit closer. I'll hit the 3D logo up top. And you can do this without any card. You can just look around any of the cars and do what you want. We'll go ahead and zoom in to the inside. So the interior is very similar to the 650S. One of the main differences is the center console. It does not come all the way down right in here. And you have all your driving modes down here with your launch control and everything. And right here you actually get a cup holder and a little extra storage. And then this is McLaren's new uh, GPS screen. You got the standard steering wheel. And changing the exterior colors we can change the interior as well. See some cool looks. And being a more entry level vehicle, they have made this a little bit more livable. So the door sills back here are actually a little bit lower, so it's a little bit easier to get in and out of. Because what McLaren says is the average owner of this car, this is probably going to be their only supercar, so they'll be driving this a lot more than the average 650S owner. So we'll go back to the digital version. And from what they told me at the McLaren dealer, there will be a spider version of this car coming out in a year or two. So it'll be interesting to see if they do a manual removable target roof or an actual automatic roof like the 650S. I'm sure they'll have to do whatever they need to do to keep it at a lower price point. So now in the app we'll do the x-ray, get to take a look at the underside of this vehicle. And if you check in our YouTube channel, we do have a walk around video of the 12C frame. They had one of them sitting at the dealership. And as well we have a walk around of the McLaren P1. There's the beautiful 3.8 liter twin turbo V8 with the rear mounted seven speed transmission. So there you go everybody, that is a nice walkthrough of the digital version of the all new McLaren 570S. Very cool app and of course McLaren's gonna go all out on making an awesome app for such a cool car. 
So thank you all for watching and don't forget to subscribe.